General Hospital spoilers for Tuesday, November 5th, predict that Robert Scorpio is angry because Holly Sutton has lied to him over and over again. Previously, Holly lied about having nothing to do with those diamonds. Of course, those lies will make it impossible for Robert to pay attention and protect Holly at this time. This means that Holly will soon be attacked and injured, without any defense. Then, Holly also kept quiet about Sasha Gilmore being Robert's daughter. Robert is hurt and devastated after what he just discovered. Of course, Robert will choose not to forgive Holly. Then, Tuesday will also revolve around the issue of Sam McCall's death. Of course, everyone will be extremely saddened by Sam's sudden passing, especially her loved ones. Molly Lansing Davis and Christina Corinthos Davis decide to stop their fight. In fact, Alexis Davis was the one who asked for it to happen. Alexis had lost her eldest daughter, Sam, and was fed up with Molly and Christina continuing to see each other as enemies. Alexis forced Molly and Christina to focus on the next thing, which was to worry about Sam's funeral. Of course, Alexis also affirmed that if Molly and Christina did not listen this time, Alexis would be forced to act. That means Alexis was ready to punish her two remaining daughters, if it was really necessary. Danny Morgan will try to act strong in front of his sister, Scout Quartermain. The fact that he lost his mother also made Danny really heartbroken and weak, but Danny only showed emotions when Scout was not around. Danny shed tears when Carly Spencer gave Danny a shoulder to lean on at this time. Jason Morgan also knew what his son, Danny, had been and was going through. Jason then hugged Danny and gave him other words of comfort. Back to Scout, she will ask questions about her mother's death and Drew Quartermain will be the one to answer. Drew was also completely surprised by Sam's death, Drew showed pity for such a short fate. Then Drew has another intention. It seems he wants to find a new woman to take care of Scout. Of course Drew will temporarily raise his daughter and carry out this intention after Scout has calmed down her longing for her birth mother. Laura Collins is also the one who will have a conversation with her nephew, Rocco Falconeri. It turns out that Rocco blames himself for being the one who caused Sam's death. Rocco talks about if Rocco had not insisted that Dante Falconeri find a liver donor for Lulu Spencer. Perhaps Sam would not have died, Rocco thinks that he was selfish for the sake of his birth mother, causing Danny and Scout's mother to die. Laura will try to give a reasonable explanation for the current problem, of course Rocco will feel a little relieved afterwards. Speaking of Dante, he is just like Rocco when he blames himself. Sonny Corinthos will comfort his son Dante, of course Sonny will not want Rocco's support for Dante to be weak at this time. Sonny affirms that no matter how much Dante is suffering, Dante and Rocco will eventually overcome this pain. Finally, Damien Spinelli will also share some problems with Jason when they discuss having to say a final farewell to Sam. Spinelli recalls that it was Sam who made Spinelli and Jason have a beautiful friendship and also used to be partners together. Of course Spinelli also wants to know if Jason can overcome the pain of having to say goodbye to his ex-girlfriend forever. Many predictions show that Spinelli will later find something related to Sam's death. Of course, Spinelli and Jason will discover the truth, and if they know that someone intentionally killed Sam, they are ready for revenge.